This is Fox News Alert. As we just told you, the New York Times released tonight new information on the decade of the president's taxes. Trace Gallagher has been taking a close look at what they put out there and joins us with an update on it. Trace? Hi, Tucker. We're scanning the article. It's important to note off the top, the tax records do not include information or tax years at the center of the president's escalating battle with Congress. There are no allegations of crimes or financial misdeeds. Instead, the records go back to the late 80s, early 90s, years the president has already admitted were at the very least tumultuous. For example, the Times is reporting that by the time Donald Trump's Art of the Deal book hit shelves in 1987, he was already in deep financial distress, meaning tens of millions in debt, and during the decade from 1985 to 1994, the Times says Trump's losses totaled just over $1.1 billion. Remember, this is investors and loan money primarily. A few points there. During that time, Mr. Trump bought Eastern Airlines shuttle for $365 million. It never turned a profit, and he was spending upwards of $7 million a month to keep it up and flying. And his Taj Mahal hotel and casino, it opened in 1990 with more than $800 million in debt. And to keep the Taj floating, Trump's businesses pulled money from other casinos, placing them in the red as well. Now, the Times is reporting because of all the losses that, that Trump paid no federal taxes in eight of the 10 years. Charles J. Harder, who's a lawyer for the president, told the Times on Saturday that the information was demonstrably false and the statements about the tax returns 30 years ago are highly inaccurate, saying, and I'm quoting here, IRS transcripts, particularly before the days of electronic filing, are notoriously inaccurate and would not be able to provide a reasonable picture of any taxpayer's returns. We should also point out the Times did not obtain the actual tax returns. They got the information from someone who was unidentified, who had access to the tax information. We're still scanning, Tucker. If we come up with more stuff, we'll bring it to you. Okay. Wait till they get yours and mine. <laughs> Trace Gallagher, <laughs> good to see you. Thanks.